Russia is again halting the supply of natural gas to Europe via its Nord Stream 1 pipeline. Moscow says its only pipeline exporting gas to Europe will be temporarily unavailable due to maintenance at a compressor station. Gazprom says the three-day work is necessary and must be carried out after every 1,000 hours of operation. Russia announced the halt well in advance, but the head of Germany's federal network agency says the maintenance work is technically incomprehensible and insists it's a way of punishing Germany for siding with Ukraine since the Russian invasion of Ukraine began. Germany is among the EU nations most reliant on Russian gas. It imports one third of its supply from Moscow. EU nations continue to blame Russia for weaponizing gas supplies, while Moscow maintains the technical trouble is all being caused by Western sanctions. France has accused Moscow of using energy supplies as a weapon of war. Tuesday's allegation comes as Russia's Gazprom reduced deliveries to one of France's main utilities. The major pipeline, the main conduit for Russian gas into Europe, has become a flashpoint in the economic war between Moscow and Brussels. The Kremlin said Tuesday that technological problems caused by Western sanctions were the only things standing in the way of supplying gas through Nord Stream 1. But France's energy transition minister said Tuesday that very clearly Russia was using gas as a weapon of war. The minister was speaking after French utility Engie said it would receive less gas from Gazprom from Tuesday due to an unspecified contractual dispute. European governments are trying to find a response to soaring energy costs for businesses and households. They also want to find alternatives to Russian supply to store for winter. Western nations fear that Moscow is driving up gas prices to try and weaken their resolve in opposing the invasion of Ukraine. Moscow denies doing this. European energy ministers will hold an emergency meeting on September 9th to discuss the crisis. A source in Italy said Germany is open to discussing a price cap scheme on gas supplies at a European level. Italian Prime Minister Mario Draghi has been pushing for a price cap and called for steps to decouple the cost of electricity from the gas price. Earlier, we on spoke with Wojciech Jakovic, an energy analyst from Warsaw, the, the capital of Poland, and he told us about the consequences of the gas outages for European nations. Russia is constantly limiting gas supplies to Europe since vacations 2021. It is an intentional policy aimed at paralyzing European support for the Ukraine in the face of Russian invasion. Gazprom is limiting gas supplies further on. It is limiting it for Germany, Italy, France, to make those countries stop supporting Ukraine to use energy crunch to paralyze the West. It is a clear sign of weaponizing gas supplies. And the only solution for this issue is to diversify away from Russia and to stop Russian invasion in Ukraine. 